Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more EU4, the Lion of the North, and it is indeed the Lion of the North. If you would have seen in the last episode, we finished the Holy War. We were victorious. Protestant is the official faith. We could get elected if we really wanted to. Not going to. Matter of fact, I think this series is going to be over. Um, this is not going to be the last episode, because I do want you guys to let me know if there's anything major that you'd like me to like to see us do other than eating up Denmark. Um, Admin Tech 20 is a ways off and we could just go until we form Scandinavia. But I just want to know what the end goal of this series is. Um, really, I'm not too interested in going much farther than where we're at right now. So let me know what you guys think. But in this one, we are definitely going to be finishing up our war. We are going to reconquest a bunch of his lands and we're going to fill in the gaps as well. Because I don't have to pay to core it, right? So, as far as his army goes, he doesn't really have one, so that's good. Um, some separatists. So, we're going to do a quick little U-turn there and come up here and wipe these guys out. Austria broke their alliance with Ravensburg. However, will they survive? So we're a little low on money, actually. We have some loans. What's the deal with that, huh? We could totally collect down here. Matter of fact, I think we should. Uh, let's collect instead of steering from Kakov. And that should give us a decent little boost to our income. Give us an extra like four or five ducats a month, right? Seven. pretty good obviously it's not as much as we'd like but we can also turn off our forts do we have oh yeah we're looking good okay cool we can turn I eh, probably should keep these ones down here on just because we don't want to risk Chernigov slipping people into my lands and then being a jerk about it so how do you get a wall breach down there that's wild man so Russia has a disputed succession. He hates me. Corruption is growing. And I wonder if it's because we have cores. Yes. Uh, yeah. We're going to be taken out alone. So this army over here. We have a huge army. We have a legitimately huge army. 70k? Is that really what we have? Uh, well, we could probably get rid of any of our mercs if we have any. Doesn't look like we do, though. Man of many chins can be putting down rebellious folk over this way. And Corbett can lead them over here. Catholic zealots over there. Very good. Definitely no Catholics in our land. Absolutely frickin' not. And you guys are gonna come up here. Very good. This debt, man. Hopefully, we can get a little bit of, uh, oh, let's stay here. Oh, hey, we won that one really quick. Let's get that loot tick. Get down here, split you guys. So, we have them as a vassal. Gonna need to improve with them so we can annex them. Yep, we can annex them next month, actually. Oh, hey, I think that's actually, aside from this one province, when's our truce with them up? We don't have one? Oh, we don't have a truce with them. Well, in that case, let's get some let's get some claims, right? Yeah, you guys can go siege that down. That's fine with me. Matter of fact, it's already defensiveness. Very good. 42-day siege ticks. I like it a lot. Another siege, another uh, loot tick over here. Ooh, lots of loot in Kiev. Let's go loot that. Try to keep my finances above water as best you can. As best as... Alright, get you guys over here. Okay. So, uh, we don't need to improve with Silesia. Don't really need to improve with you. Don't think a coalition's gonna happen. Bohemia's got a truce. Damn. 
That's pretty bad. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Maybe we should improve with them for a minute. But anyways, um, you're going to return all of Lithuania's cores here. Let me make sure here. That one, nope. That one, that one, that one. These two and those two. This one here. Very good. He would actually accept that piece right now. How funny is that? How many cores is that? I don't even know. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 cores, roughly. It's pretty good. Alright, so let's get you guys up here. And just see what else we can get real quick. Get that seat, get that loot tick there. And there's no more forts. Yeah, Smolensk. Get up there. Might actually take that fort. That'd be annoying. Peace negotiations. No, he didn't get it. Very good. So I actually think he doesn't have a core on this one right here that he just took. Yeah. I guess I don't really care if he wins that little siege up there. Okay, so let's get you guys all grouped up here. So this is an, an artillery only stack. Pretty good. Let's go with uh, Patrick Lewenhaupt. We won that one. Let's just get you guys artillery only stack. Super reckless. There you go. Finish sieging them down. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I don't think so. Ah, crap. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. I'm gonna lose those artillery because I need to win this siege before. Wait. Let's see here. I switched that over to Lithuania. And then these two. He won't accept it because of... Ah, 25 from ongoing battles. Feels bad, man. It's fine. We'll take... We'll just lose the artillery. 75 ducats. It's not a big deal. Okay, I could really use the economic help. Matter of fact, I think I'm gonna have to. I don't think I really have a choice. So let's uh, harvest siege him down. Hopefully he just goes and sits on a port somewhere. That would be really nice. So we can 100% him. There we go. Carpet siege, carpet siege, carpet siege. go get a couple of loot ticks as well looks like we have it's fine so he is full occupied we can get that hundred percent very good so the borders for Lithuania are gonna be looking a little bit nicer here very good I could totally use this as an as an in to get to war with Russia again and I very well may Gonna definitely do some dev here. Um, let's look at our edicts here. So we're losing a ton of money because of the edicts, I, I reckon. So let's uh, turn these edicts off. Ah. All right, and that should actually save us a ton of cash. And then let's actually, so Bergslagen, Berg, yeah, Bergslagen. So let's, let's dev up these two. Let's dev up all this state actually. Dev this one as well. Very good. That should help our income a bit as well. Oh, yeah. Well, 
Not that's a little misleading, but yeah, it's good. So Lithuania has one random core over here. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. So he's gonna love me no matter what because I returned a bunch of cores to him. I don't think he's gonna let me convert him though. That's kind of a bummer. So he has no army because of debt, I reckon. Yeah. So you guys are going to be supportive. You guys will be sieging and you guys will be aggressive. Um, so they just have a bunch of forts, it says. Fine. So that's a, a good looking vassal right there. Honestly, I kind of don't want him to get a huge army because then he'll be um, annoying. <laughs> So one thing I could do, since this is um, Protestant, and, and I'm pretty sure this is how this works. I can't do it until I get the, the achievement, but I can release the Teutons. Um, they have cores until, yeah, they have cores for like forever. I can release the Teutons, and since they're Protestant and they'll have Admin Tech 10, they will immediately form Prussia. So this is a thing that I wasn't sure about, but now I I have tested it and it is indeed true. Very cool. All right, so we have a ton of heavies over here. Let's go protect trade over in the Baltic. Matter of fact, we should, we should not be protecting in the Baltic. Let's turn that fort on. We should be protecting in Lubeck. We should have our dude right there, and that should bump up our income a little bit as well. So 28.25, 28.26 up to what? Okay, that's good. Uh, go ahead and go kill them. So who does Denmark have? Nobody I'm worried about. So let's just make sure that Bornholm is the last one we need. So we have Sweden is not overpowered. Rostock, Bornholm, and Wismar. So. Let's go ahead and send him a gift. Get a annexin. Don't want the extra AE. That would be bad. Wait, what? February? Did it not say like December of a couple years ago? That was weird. So let's ask for some contributions, pay off our debt, turn army maintenance down nice and low for a little bit. Nope, that's not true. We actually have a ton of rebels that are about to fire, so go ahead and uh, get them covering this over here then. Just for the time being, I think we should probably get everything cleared up real quick before we go doing anything else. So we can take our next idea group in a moment. Um, see here trade or economic is kind of what I'm eyeballing I don't really intend on leaving Europe economic would be really good trade would be super good but we, most of our trade is in like Lubeck and it over here so it's kind of not worth let me see here what's this trade look like up here so we would own most of Lubeck I think we go trade I do think we go trade. We're already focusing Diplo. It's a shame that we have no Diplo points here, but we can fall behind on Diplo tech for all I care. That's fine. Um, let us convert some stuff. Preferably stuff that's not stupid expensive. Uh, yep, this is fine. We're a little low on the manpower, but that's okay as well. Uh, let's get up here. We have no more rebels up here. Let's come up to Gdansk. Put these rebels down over here for him for a moment. Why do you have rebels? Intolerance. I suppose I could convert for him. Probably be in his best interest. Let's actually switch over to that. Uh, disputed succession in Kiev? Russia, man. Russia's almost got a... Really, a noble from the OPM of Kiev is going to inherit, <clears throat> not inherit, but raise to the throne. So states in 
What is this one? This Vickle something. Here we go. Very good. So our income looks good again. We're good. Um, so we have claims on Bornholm and Shellen. Let's also... Come on now. Annex him. It'll take about two years. We want to rival... Bohemia. Makes more sense. It's a disgusting border gore over here. What's this about? Moldavia is not even in Moldavia. Bohemia is in what? Ruthenia? Is this called Ruthenia? Red Ruthenia? Sandomir's? Malopolska? Um, Kironia could be literally like 10 dev, so I'm not going to do it. Are we missing some guys? All right, because we lost a couple of our cannons. Rip. Damn, dude. Lots of rebels over here. Go fight them. You. Why are you not? Really? Damn. Now they'll go fight them. We're on a fort, so it's fine. Tick tech ahead of time, not worth. Instead, I will gladly spend a couple of points on that, and let's actually make sure we have the edicts turned off over here. Because it's costing us money. Oh yeah, our income looks good. So Bohemia is not our rival again, but now they are again, so it's fine. So our PP is totally fine. Our golden era is until four years from now. Hmm. So Chernigov is in a truce with us. Russia has one for a couple more years. Who are you? What? Occupied by Morocco? What in the world? Probably best if we ally him. Make sure that our if we do get a coalition that it doesn't form. I forgot we had the Ottoman. Looking good. Alright, so I think we go to war with Denmark here. Let's switch you over to here. And then um, we should probably... How many transports do we have? 11. So we should, we should probably get you guys transported over there. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. Who's he allied to again? So Ottomans are over here? Damn! Well, no wonder you're occupied by Morocco. Actually, auto auto occupied by the Ottoman. Alright, so you would be joined by a bunch of folk I don't care about. Are you going to have any more rebels over here? Eh, maybe down here. It's fine. Let's get you guys over here. Just make sure we can play some catch. So... He's not in a war. All right, I think we do it. We go for Shellen and we do the attack. We make them commit not alive anymore. Beat up on the ships. All right, come on now. Go sink their ships. There we go. Good, we can put you back over here. So we should... Bosnia is an OPM. Provence is going to keep them. That's a weird looking Provence. Looks like he annexed part of Brittany. Um, I think we should... No, oh, never mind. We, we sit and we wait. Yeah, it's fine. You can totally catch these guys over here. That would be ideal. I should probably get my infantry off that stack so they're not taking all that attrition. Actually, I should probably take my horsies off as well. Should be a super easy war. As far as what we're taking, can't really take a whole lot because of AE. Oh well, then again.
Damn. We'll see. Well, let's let's think out here. So Salzburg, Russia, Poland. Most of these people I don't care about at all. Austria is the only one I'm worried about. Austria and Bohemia. They're not going to join it. All right. Let's uh, come over here and see if we can catch you guys. All right. I'm going to have to take these guys out and then head over that way. Uh, free stab. Please and thank you. Should be able to uh, just completely sink that sh fleet or not. It's fine. Get you guys over here. Convert for... Wait, what? Oh, religious zeal, I assume. Alright, so let's convert Marienburg. And let's go take out his rebels for him. Like, we could peace out for Bornholm. Basically, yeah, we could do it right now if we wanted to. Integration is a slow process. You are now mine. What are you jerks doing down here? Okay, let's get you guys joined up. 30th of October? Really? Quite the long time. But it'll be nice because we can get get a free kill on an uh on a cav. So I want to get there on the thirty first. Or the 2nd of November, whatever works. So it'll pop up here. See, boom. And uh, 25 ducats dead, gone for him. Beautiful. Beautiful thing. I think that's all of his land. Yeah, he doesn't have any more land. Not that I'm aware of. Very good. So as far as AE goes, I don't think we can afford to take any of this. We really... Because we took a ton. Like, we took all of this land in the... In the war. Like, literally all of this, I think we took and released Silesia. So, um, let's see if we can steal any of his ships. Nope. Uh, all right, cool. Well, let's do the piece. Let's take all your money. Oh, come on now. I can't transfer his trade power. Can you not transfer trade power to him? I wish there was a way that you could cancel that. Because, like, I, I just want to take his trade power. No longer transfer trade to Denmark. Whatever. I'll take that trade power, I suppose. It's kind of lame, but it's fine. Send you guys down here. Get you guys grouped up over here as well. Alright, let's get you guys over here. See if we can stop them from being annoying. So we want to take all of that over there. Very good. And then all of your money. Every ducat you got. I wonder if he's in any debt right now. Denmark, 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 Denmark. Oh, he's way down here. No debt. Not a bit. Very good. I guess we can lose some land to the... Uh... He doesn't have a whole lot of money, so we'll just take whatever he can give us. It's fine. And uh, with that... Well, next month we should have the achievement here. What? I don't think I said we had- Oh wait, we have to core it. Derp. Ignore me. <laughs> and I'm actually just gonna- Since I'm black flagged, I'm just gonna run up here. Free diplo point sounds good to me. I'm gonna wait a little bit longer before we take tech. And uh, let's just go ahead and drill there for a little bit. More rebels. Uh, so, it's like Corbett didn't make it. Come over here and take out his rebels for him. Let's actually pay off Lithuania's debt as well. Damn, dude. What do you have so much debt from? Interest? 
Pay off your loans. You still have debt. Stop having debt. Let's go ahead and just give him subsidies for a little bit so he'll build up an army. Three ducats sounds good for 10 years. Yeah, we can do that. Let's uh, go ahead and raise that autonomy. The last thing I want to do is have rebels over there. Like we might actually anyways. Coalition might be forming here soon. I think I probably have to attack Russia when our truce is up, which is going to be in February of next year. I think I kind of have to attack him. So let's get a couple, some spy network built up. Let's also get some claims on you. So he is Protestant. He's going to flip to reform because of this, um, these dudes over here. Uh, do I have claims on all that? All the stuff? Yeah, it's fine. All right, let's improve with, uh, get a royal marriage with you. We're topped off with Ottomans, so that's good. Um, eh. It's money that I feel like I could spend other places, so I'm not going to do it. How much do I need to embrace? Oh, like nothing anymore, so we're good. And this is what? Many of... What is this? Printing press? Denmark has collapsed. They are now still Protestant. Weird. Okay, I suppose we need to send some men over here. And we lost our guy. Bummer. Can we do the clicks yet? No, but we can't get grant an admiral, so let's do that. And uh, you guys can have him. Only one pip, which is kind of a bummer, but it is what it is. Hey, there we go. Sweden is not overpowered. Very good. Boom. So, the mission of the, uh, here, you don't need to go down there, that's fine. The mission of the entire series has been accomplished. So, let's actually have you guys, there we go. Get rid of those re rebels. Ornholm now? M what more do you want from me, man? Alright, let's wait one more month. Heck up. It's fine with me. I get money? Give me money, please. Alright. So we are going to embrace. We are going to take this and that, and then we are going to take... Do we go trade? See, now I'm second-guessing myself. Tell me what you tell me what you guys think. I'm going to hold off. I'm not going to embrace this tech yet. I'm going to wait till the next episode. Let me know what you guys think we should do. Because um, I want to see. I want your input first. We got our new uh, cav, so that's cool. We can build a couple of these guys, and we will. Cool, that's going to do it. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, show your support and leave a like. We got a thick Lithuanian vassal, which is really nice. Be help helpful bulwark against uh, the Ruskies, who apparently are pretty thick anymore. But we'll take care of them in the next episode. Looks like our truce with them is actually up next month. So some fun stuff to be had there. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Like the series like the video if you're liking the series and uh, if you want to check out the discord or support the channel on patreon the links for those are going to be in the description down below with all that being said this is chewy shoot and i will catch you guys later big special thanks to my top supporters on patreon udaldo and corbett gaming as well as classified for life bloodbound ratty the beautiful lambda driver and damian hartvig if you guys want to check out some other series that we have going on on the channel check those two playlists linked on the right over there and don't forget to subscribe i'll catch you guys later